Just a quick video on priming the oil system in your engine, whether it's a new engine or one that hasn't run in a long time. My method is the same either way. I get myself a household garden sprayer like this, only instead of putting in plant food, I'm putting in oil. I just use whatever oil I plan to run the engine on, fill it up about a quarter of a way, that's usually enough. Take the other end of the hose and hook it up down here where you'd hook up your oil pressure gauge. Don't worry about getting too tight of a fit. We're dealing with low pressures. Uh, I just slip the rubber hose over the threaded fitting. It usually fits pretty tight and it's not a problem. So with the hose hooked up and the reservoir filled, you just want to start building up some pressure and pump it to the point where it starts to get kind of hard to push it down. And that's usually plenty. Then sit back and let it do its work. You might get oil right away. It might take a couple minutes, uh, but the, the low pressures will eventually push the oil through and you'll start to see oil come out uh, in the uh, rocker area out of the rocker arms themselves or maybe just uh, the shaft around the rockers. Uh, but wherever it's coming out, once you have oil delivered to the top end, it's a pretty good sign you're done. Um, oil has gone through the bearings, oil galleys, uh, timing chain, oil pump. It should all be lubricated. So you're good to go as far as spinning the engine. Um, that won't guarantee that you're gonna build oil pressure. So what I like to do is uh, put some oil into the priming port of the pump if you have one. Uh, if you don't, you might be able to use the pressure relief uh, valve plug or anything else that will get oil into the gears um, and uh, down into the body of the pump to get that suction you need to pull oil up out of the sump. If you still can't get pressure uh, when you crank the engine, another trick I like to use is to once again put oil into the pump itself, hopefully through a priming port or possibly through uh, some other means. Get the oil in there as much as you can. Raise one wheel of the car, rear wheel, off the ground. Uh, put it in gear and spin that wheel backwards. That'll turn the engine backwards. So instead of pulling oil up from the sump, you're pumping oil down through the pickup tube, pushing any air that's in there out. Uh, and uh, as the pump starts to drain of oil, just keep topping it up as necessary. Shouldn't take very much. You should be able to get the air out of there pretty quickly. And uh, now you have what you need to get suction and build some pressure. So at that point, go ahead and crank the engine over and uh, you should have pressure. I like to crank the engine with the plugs out just because it's easier on everything. It won't be building compression. It'll spin faster and easier. It's just easier on everything. So uh, I've already given this a five second burst. So uh, let's spin it again and we'll see what happens. That'll do it. So uh, that's my method for doing this. Other people have their methods. Uh, everybody's got their own secret sauce for success. Um, but uh, that's what I found works for me. So hopefully it works for you too. And um, hope that helps. Happy motoring.